I would like to share with you before we get going. I know that some of you are going like this. They're working on that. Um, I have about 19 announcements, so, so try and stay with me. After our second service this morning, we're going to have something called Getting... Got a green light. Like, getting to know Crosspoint, I'm just going to yell. <laughs> we have a class called Getting to Know Crosspoint that will be meeting after our second service. It lets you know a little bit more about what our church is about. If you have not signed up for that, there are still spaces, so please come and be a part of that. Second announcement, we have a number of openings on our deacon board that we just want to communicate to you so that you're aware and that you're in prayer for those who will be serving. Uh, we have we will be having elections in June to solidify a deacon of missions. We've already let you know that we're looking for one of those. We will have an opening in lay ministries. We also have uh, two positions that are up for re-election, and that would be children and student ministries, where Robin Young has served wonderfully, and John Batts in human resources. So we are going to bring those individuals forward for re-election as well. Next week. We're going to have an important announcement with regards to our capital campaign and what is happening in the, the ceiling, above the ceiling here, uh, what's happening up there. Uh, we also have a women's ministry conference. You can uh, see more at the kiosk when you go to the top of the stairs here. It's called uh, Real Joy with K. Arthur. That's going to be in the fall, but you need to buy your tickets now. And then, after second, after this service, if you are of career age, meaning, and this is what I mean, some of you are like, what is that? If you have uh, exited kind of that college graduate time, and you are now, whether or high school graduate, and you are now beginning your career, you're in that beginning of your career mode in that age group, there's going to be a meeting for you up in the church apartment where Catalyst, uh, the life group that we have for that age group will be meeting, and it, there's Sunday. They're having Sundays on Sunday. It's clearly meant to draw you there. Now, don't just go if you like ice cream. Go if you fit what they're looking for. We also want to be praying this week for the Myron family, Jennifer, and her husband, John, uh, welcomed their a second child, a little boy named August. And so you'll want to be praying for them. That's the Myrons. And right now, I believe, we're going to have a video. When the video ends, you're welcome to stand up and greet those around.